Hey there friends, welcome to another unboxing and review. Checking out this Hume Health uh, body pod scale. This has a ton of different metrics. Uh, body weight, muscle, uh, fat percentage. If you're looking to get a good scale, um, it's important to be able to like kind of understand how accurate it's gonna be. Okay, we got this right here. It's a little sticker on here, how to use it. So it's got this little guy on here. This pulls out pretty cool looking. All right, so let's uh, download the app here and uh, set this up, shall we? All right, got the app, the Hume Health app on my phone here. And just basically, I'm gonna stand on this and just put your thumbs on the contact points and lift this out. It's gonna tell you on the app, like what it's doing. It's gonna download all your metrics on there. We'll check out the app here. So it takes a little bit of time, but basically using electricity um, to go through your body and to calculate everything that it can. As far as accuracy is, um, this body pod is uh, super accurate. We'll check out the uh, actual uh, statistical metrics here it has uh, compared to other ones. Okay, so I have some data here for us. So with so many scales to choose from, they're all claiming to be, you know, really good. Um, so as far as like weight accuracy, most of them are pretty similar off by not more than probably like a pound or something. They got, most scales have the weight down a lot, but as far as like body fat composition, uh, water, um, makeup, all these different things, there's so many different metrics that we can look at. So let's just kind of go over this here. So how do you know like which one's like that accurate as far as like, like a scientific breakdown of the different um, reliabilities and things. So we have on this uh, little thing, we have the gold standard, which is basically the DEXA. Um, yeah, it's gonna tell you pretty much the most accurate of the statistics. This is body mass index, fat, uh, water, all the all the different metrics that this thing can list. So we can see that the human body scale has a uh, pretty, as far as 98% third party validated. And then we check out the report here. It's kind of shows you the body pod versus the DEXA correlation here. So um, yeah, it just seems to be pretty much within, right in within that, uh, just a few percentage marks of the, the DEXA, which is really impressive if you look at the cost basis of these. Anyways, um, all right, friends. So we are checking out the Hume app here and it has a really, I like this feature a lot. Just basically shows your body breakdown, uh, how my age, metabolic age, how you put in a lot of stuff beforehand, you type that in and it's gonna kind of give you um, a bunch of different metrics here. So here we, we're looking at the fat percentage on my body and then we can switch it up and go to muscle percentage. And I like, I like how it gives you like a standard kind of like where you're at and then like maybe like low or high and things, areas we might need to work on, but you can like kind of customize a workout based on this. It's just got plans that you can go with like classes, a ton of different things on here. Um, really like the body metrics. We can go for a day, week or month, how long we've been doing it, how long we're weighing ourselves keep your progress. So, I mean, it's, this is basically just trying to get healthy or whatever. So you have a, a good scale that's actually going to be able to tell you, like a lot of people get frustrated. They, they go to start working out, you know, they want to drop some weight. And initially they're like, man, I'm, I'm gaining weight, but they don't realize, Hey, they're working out muscle weighs more than fat. So perhaps they're losing fat, gaining muscle. So they get frustrated. If you have this, this scale, this app, it's going to tell you like, Oh, you just lost you know, such and such amount of body percent fat, you can see it's dropping on your metrics here. Um, but you've also gained muscle mass. So that's a really nice way to just be able to track that and just like not get frustrated and like have an understanding like, hey, I'm actually am getting fitter and you can't always just go off of weight, that's for sure. So um, yeah, it just has the weight here, body fat percentage, uh, lean mass percentage, subcutaneous fat, visceral fat, skeletal muscle, uh, skeletal mass, body water percentage, extracellular, intracellular, mineral mass, I mean, basal metabolic rate, it's a little high, metabolic age is excellent, that's cool, resting heart rate 90 standard, so it just has so many metrics here, and it's just a really nice way to be able to track, you can be confident that this has really good accuracy, and so 
in order to just like kind of get on that level that you want to be and be able to track everything nicely and see what works for you as far as like changing different things and, and what works more because you can see day by day say hey if i do a bunch of cardio is it helping with this or not or if am i doing calisthenics or if i'm doing like lifting heavy and you can see how maybe try each week and, and see what changes in that area so just uh yeah guys this, the scale is super accurate it does a really good job i mean it takes about 30 seconds when you stand on it to get all your readings which is it's cool um it's small it's compact portable you can take it with you the app is just legit it's really cool if you guys want to check it out i'll link it in the description below thanks so much for watching this review i hope it's helpful you guys have a great day and i'll see you all next time